people for this enchanted Legolas um, episode of Legolas, the Legolas 09 show. I'm going to try to come up with a name for my show. <laughs> my code word, though, is like Legolas 09. That's what I always say at the beginning of my videos, but... I'm gonna start saying like we're having a review here at like the the Woodland Hub or whatever. Something to do with Legolas. <laughs> um, but yeah, so today we have the Series 8 minifigure, the fairy. I was actually most people, most boys wouldn't be too thrilled, but I kind of was, cause you get a lot of rare and valuable pieces in this set. Now other people with Legos would probably look at this from a different angle. I look at it from like a like how fun would this be to use and things and I have a lot of like of this magic stuff like I have this I have all these like book like magic books and stuff just laying around um yeah and then and then you get this really cool wand piece um so, yeah there you go. Um, <clears throat> so, let's get to the minifig. I'm sorry if it might be a little bit uneven. I had this on my tripod, and I don't know how to completely unscrew it. So there's like this little knob on the bottom right now. I tried to do my best. Um, okay, so here's like an overall look at the minifig. Basic base plate. Um, you get this really cool looking hair. It almost looks like, like, pop star hair. I couldn't tell who I really, like, when I opened this, I couldn't tell who I really got. Um, because I'm like, what kind of hair piece is that? And then, this is the, I bought three. I'm going to review the other two. Um, the Conquistador and the Deep Sea Diver were the other two. Um, but I'm going to, um, this... This one I, it was the only one that I did not feel, and I'm pretty actually glad that I got a good one, or one that I didn't get before. Um, but if I got one that I didn't get before, some of them it would kind of suck to get another one, but some of them it would be good. Like if I got another, like if I got another Deep Sea Diver, I wouldn't be too thrilled, because Deep Sea Divers, there's only like supposed to be one of them. If I got another Fairy, another, um, like whatchamacallums another businessman like this guy um would be great because i can like make like a little stop motion i've been working i might guys i might make a stop motion film um because of i will uh because i've been building all these backdrops and lego homes and stuff as you can see here i'm helplessly working on a snake I just need to find one of those tooth pieces, and it'll kind of look like a giant snake. Uh, but yeah, so. Um, well, so, let's get to this now. Just basic place plate, as I told you. It's really cool hair. Here's the wand piece. It's pink, which is the only downside of this, that everything is all pink. Um, then we have a face with... Uh, pink flower on it like right in the my right hand corner right now but it's like right there where I'm tapping with my thumb uh, but yeah then we get these really cool wing pieces which make me think that they're gonna start doing like the Lego fairies or a Lego Tinkerbell series so if you like Tinkerbell um, or fairies um, the, you should kind of get excited about this minifig. And they haven't really made that great girl minifigs, um, in the Lego series, but they finally come through, I guess. Um, so yeah, here we have the, just torso, it's kind of like a rugged look to it. Another, another pink flower. Um, then we have, the, this piece is really confusing. I think that they should have just made, it's like a grass skirt. I think that they should have just made it like they did in the ARC Trooper, um, the Commando ARC Trooper set. 
Um, but because it's just so confusing how you put it on. I I don't know if I even have, still have it right. But so you like put those on. You oh well, I'll show you that in a little bit because when I do the <coughs> put together the mini fig thing, then you just have like a little skirt there. Um, so yeah, so let's do that now. You just take these two, kind of put them on each other, then, wait, no, I'm doing it backwards. Okay, so, <clears throat> sorry, I'm kind of losing my voice a little bit. I don't know, I could be losing my voice, could just be that, um, I don't know, I could, I don't know what it could be. So, yeah, you just kind of put it like that. So I like how they made that cool little grass look to it. I'm glad that they didn't just have like a grass overlay piece though. I'm glad how they gave it that. Oh, I forgot about the wing. I knew I was missing something. I was all looking around, but. Um, yeah. So, when you do that, put on the hair, then give it its accessory pink wand, which is actually pretty cool except for the color. I don't really like pink. Then you just put it on the base plate. Wait, did, I don't think you caught any of that, but yeah, I think, yeah, I think you didn't really, but you kind of just put, slip that on around the neck because, again, it's on the, see, it's like wobbly because it's on the treadmill bottom thing, but anyways. So that concludes it for this 2012 Lego set review.